Welcome to Breakdown. This is Blaine Didasco. We're looking at the Los Angeles Rams versus the New York Giants in week six. Taylor Rapp's first interception of two in this game. The Rams ultimately go on to win this game 38 to 11 and move on to 5 and 1. As we look at this play, we'll start with the offensive formation. It's a Daniel Jones at quarterback, three by one shotgun formation with three receivers split out to the right. The Rams match it with what appears to be a two high or cover two look with uh, Jordan Fuller and Nick Scott at the safeties, Robert Rochelle and Dante Dion on the outsides with Jalen Ramsey and Taylor Rapp on the insides. The route concept here will be the number three receiver going upfield to work in between the safeties and the one and two receivers on in-cutting routes to work underneath. Here's Taylor Rapp working the number three receiver. He's in a zone concept, so he's going to allow his guy to go upfield. And the number three receiver, who will end up being the target receiver, is looking to work in between the safeties. Taylor Rapp's going to let his guy go. Daniel Jones sees this uh, while the Rams rush five, uh, providing a little bit of pressure so Jones can't drop too deep or hold on to the ball. So here he decides to take a shot. There's Taylor Rapp, eyes on the quarterback, reading his vision. Uh, what Daniel Jones doesn't account for is that Taylor Rapp, although letting his guy go, doesn't bite hard enough on this under route, puts himself instead in good position to make the jump and the interception. So as far as awareness and ability, Taylor Rapp gets credit for making this play. But now let's have a look at scheme. Uh, the other thing that contributes to this play, besides Daniel Jones not looking off his receivers, are the defensive scheme. Starts in the cover two look, which ends up being a disguised coverage. Here's Nick Scott. Here's Jordan Fuller. We're going to see on snap, Jordan Fuller rolls up high. Nick Scott rolls down. So what looks to be at first like a cover two shell ultimately becomes a cover three. Single high. What that does and what it means is, again, this number three receiver is going to work up. And while he's working up, what he's expecting to see in a basic cover two formation is the two high safeties separating into their halves of the field, opening up the middle of the field. That's what he would expect to see in a cover two. By the time he gets to that second level, he's looking over. And instead of seeing that open middle of the field, he sees an extra middle defender and what that does is causes him to short or stall his route, allowing Taylor Rapp to be in the favorable position to make the interception.